Central College a 62 to 20 winner over Buena Vista, and I guess the score that lap side, it's, it's you know it's a rough yet a little bit seeming, wasn't it? Yeah, it didn't feel like it, and uh, especially in the first half. I mean, you know, it was an interesting game. Uh, BD has a, got a very good quarterback, very good offensive scheme. I think what their their coaching staff does um, is tough to defend. I mean, every play. Um, you know, within, outside of like a third long was an RPO, run pass option. So, you're playing the run, you're playing the pass, this guy's got some escapability. Uh, they did a really nice job, they kept us up bounce, they scored. And then, you know, uh, and they went on a long drive, so they ate up a lot of clock. Then we get the, you know, the punt return for the touchdown, and they're right back out there, and it just felt like we were on the field a long time for the defense. And, you know, and that's that's the opposite of what you want. You, you know, ideally, you'd love to have your offense out there a lot, run a lot of plays, keeping your defense fresh. And it's, it's the exact opposite, even though we're up 14 7. So, you know, in my head, I'm thinking this is, you know, we're watching a lot of plays, we watch our defense in the field a lot, and, and uh, you know, just kind of thinking ahead of how the rest of the game's going to play out. That was something that we definitely were mindful of. And yet the offense really responded. It felt like kind of they had to score early, and, and they did. They did. And I, you know, we had you know very few drives, and every drive that we had, we, except for I think one, we scored on, and um, in the first half and then in the third quarter. So you know, I, I thought our offense was very efficient. They were very productive. They they executed really well. That was you know some very good offensive execution. There's things that we can do better. There's no question about that. Um, you know, we made some mistakes, but overall, I thought we executed well. Guys made plays. Coaches like routine, and you got thrown out of yours with a lightning delay. How did you feel you handled that? Well, I mean, this is a team that, you know, regardless of what, what the outcome of the game is, has handled uh, different, you know, routine changes and, and uh, schedule changes very, very well. You know, we played on the road those first two games, uh, first three games, uh, three out of four games. And, and you have a long trip down to DePauw, a long trip to Northwestern. And while you're, while you're making these trips, things are going to happen. You're in a different area, on a bus for a long time, hotels, meals, things, you know, things get delayed. And, and every single time something's happened to us with a delay or change of plans, this team in particular has really handled it in stride. And I, I give the seniors and our class a lot of credit. They're just a kind of a, a very easy going bunch when it comes to changes. So the whole the whole it gave us time to make a few more adjustments. The guys just relaxed and, and kind of kept talking and stayed loose. Five knows where you want to be. It's a good place, and, and uh, it, we control the things that we can control. We have to keep getting better. Uh, we have a lot of work to do, um, but our guys are playing really hard and they're executing well. And, and uh, you know, stay healthy, and, and uh, you know, we have a lot of good things to look forward to. All right, good job, Coach. Thanks.